In this video, I will teach you how to install Prettier inside VS Code and how to configure it so that whenever you save a file, Prettier will automatically format that file. To get started, we first need to install the Prettier extension to our VS Code. So let's open up the extensions and search for Prettier. And it's right here, this one, Prettier Code Formatter. So let's install it. Once that's done, we can close this page. So now that we have the Prettier extension installed, let's open up the workspace settings. And I'm gonna do that by command shift P and type in workspace. And it's right there, I'm gonna select that. And to this search settings section, I'm gonna search for format on save. So right here we have the editor format on save. So by ticking this box, we will configure VS Code to format any file we are saving. So let's do that. And now we still need to do one more configuration. So by checking this, uh, it will use the default formatter that whatever is set to your VS Code's default formatter at the time. So what we want to do is still uh, change the default formatter to be that prettier extension we just installed. So I'm gonna uh, search setting again and I'm gonna search for editor.default formatter. And right here we have the editor default formatter. So this defines the default formatter that we will use to format our files when we are saving them. So for this let's open up the uh, drop down and search that prettier code formatter and select that. Now once that's selected we can close this setting page and let's actually try it out. So I think it should work now. So if I open up some file that would be formatted. So I have just the JavaScript file, React file over here. So let's say I add a couple of lines here. And now when I save this, Prettier should format this file. And uh, by doing so, these empty lines will be uh, removed and only one line should remain. So I'm gonna hit save and voila, it works. So we used Prettier to format this file when we saved it. If you didn't get the file formatted when you uh, saved it, make sure you don't have any errors down there because this is, I think, the section that will display any errors that happened when the formatting was done. And also, uh, one tip is to just try to restart your uh, VS Code and open it up again. And if you still have some problems after booting it up, you don't get it to format, let me know in the comments. I'm not saying that I will have a solution for you, but at least I'm gonna try to help you. And also it enables the community to help you out if someone knows the answer for your problem. Well, that's it. If you found this video helpful, please do leave a like and hit the subscribe button below. And I'll see you in the next video.